What's good everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, I got something trending to talk about pretty much. If you haven't been keeping up with this, like on YouTube, then I don't know what you're doing. Really quickly, there are three main points this video. One, I'm gonna be talking about Rice Gum, all that stuff, how he got big, kind of like exposing him. So you definitely wanna stay tuned. And then at the end, I'm gonna be bringing all the giveaway information. I'm doing like a small little giveaway. Make sure you listen carefully towards the end and let's just get started right with it. So real quick, um, this video wasn't planned at all. I had to make this because of like the mass amount of requests I've been getting and questions to ask what's going on. Now, when you have a big name and you know other people with big names, a lot of times people talk it through and collaborate, get together, literally just for more publicity and for more views and more attention. Rice Gum, in fact, he's actually a genius and I want to go ahead and bring up the fact that I have no hate towards him. I actually have a lot of respect, much respect to Rice Gum. Uh, with all of his editing skills, with everything, he puts in a lot of work and effort into his videos. So this is no, in no way like a hate message or diss track. I'm just bringing you guys an informative video as well as trying to get out to reach with him. So let's bring it back to when his like channel first started blowing up. He started out by noticing like, oh, how can I get views? How can I get people on my channel? Because YouTube is very hard to grow on. There are thousands of people every day who sign up, who try to make content. Now what he did was he started out with like diss tracks and stuff like that. And a lot of his videos were pointed towards people with big names who are like noticeable and who have a big following, which is smart because obviously if those people were to react or to notice these videos, Rice Gum is going to go ahead and get the attention, get the subscribers. And all it is is views. I'm sure he wanted to get another source of income. And of course, with millions of views come thousands of dollars. It's just how it works. Targeting these people, which is fine because I've got into some contact with people that know him, people that have like talked to him. I personally never met him. I know some of you guys are gonna go ahead and be like in disbelief. Oh, you don't know anybody who knows rice gum, none of that stuff. I'm gonna have a picture up on the screen right here. So basically, what he did was he went ahead and gathered like a bunch of these like big names and YouTubers since now he has a name for himself. They got together, they got a bunch of ideas and they used each other's followings and instead of doing just shout outs because that's probably just going to bring into spam and not really active people. Jake Paul, all those people that like recently have been like blowing up right now. They all are good with each other. In person they have no beef, no problems. It's literally all publicity stunt and a lot of this stuff like the internet beef it's for clout. It has nothing to do with problems. They're all good. I guarantee you they all hang out or they're just like, they text each other saying like, Yo, you want to make this video real quick? Sure. Are we going to get views on this? For sure, bro. So yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how I'm down. If not, I don't know. Ricegum can tell you guys the truth if he sees this video. But yeah, so since he got that Instagram blowing up, he does this thing on his Instagram also where he'll have something hidden in the pictures. Like it'll be Photoshop and stuff. So you guys can literally go and comment and get more active and react. So it's literally all for attention, which is really good because it spreads his name more, it, it stands him out, all that stuff. And you can tell all this is working and he's definitely getting that YouTube check in because he's wearing like Bape, Supreme, all these expensive brands now. He's recently got into fashion and props on him, like salute to you, man. You're, you're definitely doing your thing. And I can see the content in your videos, like they've been getting a lot better. His old diss tracks, no lie, I was like, how, how is this guy like blowing up? Who, who cares about his music? It's so bad. Take that pile of filth out. It had no like rhyme. It had terrible beats. But nowadays, he's, he's definitely pushing up. He's definitely getting up there. His recent diss track on like Jake Paul and all them, that was his best one yet, I'm pretty sure. I mean, 40, 40 million something views. That, that can tell you something right there. But yeah, he's definitely getting better and better. And I'm sure by the end of the year, maybe like one more year, he's going to hit that 10 million. YouTube growing, it's super hard to grow on YouTube. Now, it's not really about who you are. It's more about who you know. And he just got really lucky because think about it. It doesn't really take a lot of talent to diss other people or to make trending videos and keep up with topics. He's just super lucky that he kind of blew up and he got noticed. And it's not really luck. It's also intelligence. Like he, he did play it smart. It's not really about talent, but... Like I said, he, he he knows what he's doing. To the exposing part, I just wanted to say all he does is use his like fans, supporters, all that. You can even tell in his bio, a lot of the things he puts out, all of his content, it's just it's just a joke. It's for entertainment purposes. No, he's not gonna follow you back on his bio on Instagram. His videos aren't real, like they're not really targeted towards these people. He's like I said, he doesn't have beef. He doesn't care about uh Jake, he doesn't care about all these other people he talks about. 
the Gabby girl, whatever, that, that she claims he hit him. It's all acted, it's all staging, just like a lot of entertainment these days. So don't be fooled, don't be like wasting your time commenting, arguing with your friends like, Oh, Rice come did that, Rice come did this. Literally, just enjoy the content, have a laugh at it, because at the end of the day, that's what it's there for. The, like, the roast part, like, I'm not gonna make a diss track on him because I'm nobody, like, I'm not about to get views, and he's never gonna probably see this video. In case he does, let's link, I definitely can help you out, and I'm gonna put up a picture right here, right now, um, how much he's, like, he literally bought, like, vape and stuff, like, streetwear, from way too much, like, overpriced. I'm just saying, like, he's out here really paying way too much for anything, so he doesn't really have knowledge on this. I think he needs like not a stylist but somebody who to, like needs to help him saying like bro you're paying way too much for this or that's not what it goes for I'm sure he doesn't care at all but I guarantee you if I would have had expose in the video title or something then everybody would have spammed me with clickbait so the exposing part is literally that he doesn't really know anything about all these high fashion brands he recently got into fashion only because he just got started with all this money. If you guys were keeping up, about two or three days ago, Ricegum actually dropped a video and in his vlog towards the end, him and the owner of the house, FaZe Banks, were talking about, oh, we want to bring two people on board like to our house, move in with us to LA. Because I really want to start a crew. Like, but the only way this crew thing works is if we all live in the same house. I want to change some lives, man. I want more people having like this lit LA lifestyle because it's honestly so fun. Some hardworking content creators and people that can bring something to the table. Okay, first off, I don't know about you guys, but who would want two random strangers in their house? I don't know what Ricegum is planning, this is probably another publicity stunt because he wants a lot of emails, he wants all this, because, and he did mention how you don't have to have followers, you don't have to have clout, but honestly, first off, all he did was to drop an email, so you know how many people are going to email him, there's going to be thousands of emails, there's going to be like a bunch of little kids on his Instagram, bro, bro, I want to join, blah, 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 right? So technically, he'll never notice you, like there's a thousand emails every couple hours like there's no way he can possibly see it so hence unless you have a following unless you have some kind of clout that's what, how you can kind of get his attention so people have been like commenting his username on my account and after that like after I saw a couple of comments I'm like what are people doing but I went ahead and checked did some research and I'm like oh okay so thank you to those people who started all of this and that's when I posted on my story and asked like to keep it going to keep spamming hopefully maybe he'll notice me or he'll get to my account Keep in mind, I'm a very small YouTuber, like, I got a little bit of clout on Instagram, but that really means nothing. I'm really nobody, I'm just out here trying to make something. The last but not least is where you guys come to play and where you can win free money. Yes, I decided to do a small giveaway. One, because I hit a thousand subscribers, so shout out to everybody who's been with me since day one and climbing up with me because one day I wish I make it somewhere big and I bring up people with me as well. So number two is, I'm not getting my hopes up. I know he's probably never gonna see this. He's not gonna make no type of reaction video to this in any way, but you never know. I mean, life's all about trying, and let's see where this takes us together because it's not just me. I can't do this all by myself. I did get into contact with a few people that know him, so we'll see how that goes. But in order for you to win free money, there's a few simple steps. Now listen very carefully. I'll be picking about two, three, maybe more, depending on how this goes, more than one person so a few to win a hundred dollars now this will be done through paypal so if you're like local to me like don't hit me up about it none of that i want to give everybody a fair chance you can be anywhere in the world you can be out the united states it doesn't matter you can be anybody just make sure you have a paypal and it's like active and you know what you're doing so now you're wondering how you can win a hundred dollars right it's pretty simple one make sure you are subscribed to my channel right down below and this has to do with step one make sure you comment down below on this on this video why you want to win a hundred dollars like what is it going to do to you how does it mean something to you if you do not want to comment i completely understand a lot of people don't want to like spread you know their financial situation so go ahead and message me on instagram or snapchat like you literally just send me a message snapchat is on the screen as well as instagram so message me and be like hey this is why i want the hundred dollars why it's going to help me out maybe it maybe someone's struggling right now and i can actually help somebody severely I don't know, but I definitely want to help you guys out since I'm asking for a favor. And lastly, if you could please go on his account on Instagram, it's just Rice. Go on his account, go on his recent picture, and go ahead and type in. Bro, check out AM Sneakers. 
please go check out AM Sneakers. Oh my god, did you see AM Sneakers video? So I'm gonna need you guys to blow up his account. Don't do it like spammy because one, he'll block you. Two, you'll get like blocked by Instagram or deleted. So just comment a couple times and don't just put the same comment over and over again. Make it interesting so I can see it and that's just you can stand out. So that way you have a better chance of winning. You can also go on my Instagram personally and comment his username. Just, you, you, you know what I mean, just you guys can take it from here. So basically those three steps, fairly simple, is to subscribe, comment, or message me. It's actually kind of two steps, but like, so step one, but yeah, like this video, comment down below. I'll have my filmer, my friends, a bunch of people. We will be checking all these steps. So don't try to like just skip one. That's about it for this video. I want to thank everybody who got me to where I am today. Hopefully I'm going to keep climbing, keep growing. And the goal and the dream here is to collab, go out to LA and just honestly, Rice Gum, huge props to you. Much respect to what you're doing. We'll see how this goes. If it somehow, if it somehow gets anywhere, that's it for this video. It's AM Sneakers.